first black press My ain't that nice, I can do it If you voted for me, change the way you know it If you voted for me, change the way An Obama impersonator is using that concept on the net And millions are tuning in uh, So listen, I'm Barack Obama uh, Chill out, I've got it <laughs> Mix 107.3, Jack Diamond Morning Show. If you're a fan of YouTube, you've probably seen the video, the Beyonce spoof with that guy dancing with all the fancy moves who looks and sounds exactly like Barack Obama. His name is Iman Cross. He is a superstar on the rise. Check this out. Now I'm going to have to figure out what I can change and who I can trust. Recognize that voice? It's YouTube prez Iman Cross, and whose Obama video is now at three and a half million hits. Iman made the rounds in D.C. One stop, Fox News where he put his impersonating skills to work. Well, let, 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 let's be clear. Uh, you can't call where the stimulus package is going before it's actually passed. And to radio station Mix 107.3, the Jack Diamond Morning Show. Iman, unbelievable. Thank you very much. I mean, the look, the intonation. You Thank had a you career here for at least four years. <laughs> and it started funny, too, because people at work were calling me Barack, right, but that's right. because I was the only black guy at work. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I had seen it, and I was like, oh, there's a light-skinned black guy in the news. That's cool. You know, but, uh, but I'd walk into work, and uh, people were like, you know, here comes Barack Obama. And I'm like, ha-ha. And I was like, wait a second. Uh, hmm. Perhaps I can be him. So. <laughs> Iman, we'll see you at the top, baby. I searched and I searched the far corners of the web. And now we can reveal your top ten Obama tunes. Look, I picked Joe Biden out. This one's right. As long as y'all got me, you won't need nobody. Well, forget the Obama girl. This Obama guy is now a YouTube sensation. And this presidential impersonator is getting some rave reviews. Uh, so let's just pass the bill, and then we'll see whether or not uh, I was actually right about it. That's very good. That is very, very good. Uh, so listen, I'm Barack Obama. Uh, chill out. I've got it. <laughs> That's going, to be, that's going to be on the Today Show. All the morning shows are going to be running that clip. The guy who did the Obama Beyonce thing was really funny. <laughs> okay, uh, one last thing I need you to do. Okay, and then you give me my spot back. Uh, sure. Uh, what, what's my slogan? That's easy. Change. You can believe it. Wrong. Uh, that's my campaign slogan. Uh, my slogan at home is call me during the game and we've got problems. Hello? H hello? Especially doing a bipartisan Super Bowl party. He's got a lot of open space. Enough of my answer. Run, run, run! ET on MSN, the ET network keeping you plugged into the latest Hollywood news. I'm Barack Obama and I uh, approve this message. I am Mark Steinis and only we have the YouTube Obama everyone's talking about. What are the keys to doing a good Barack? Barack has a, a slightly lower register. Uh, so uh, when you're talking, immediately it drops. Uh, so uh, there's a lot of us. Uh -huh. So uh, I, I'm, I'm very pensive. Resembling a political figure can pay off. Whether you're Tina Fey or an aspiring actor from Ohio. In the White House, now watch him out. Now I'm doing my presidential thing. 27-year-old Iman Krasan has become a YouTube sensation for his music videos impersonating President Barack Obama. Krasan says he writes, shoots, and edits the videos. And now he's landed a commercial with Sanyo. Is it too late to add this to the stimulus bill? His impression is based on careful study. But this isn't about me. It's about you. He's very pensive, and his eyes are constantly uh, almost downward as he's thinking. Uh, and he chooses his words very carefully. <laughs> MTV Live. Talk, talk. See? Hello, Barack Obama guy. Oh, it's absolutely great to meet you. <laughs> hey, are you throwing an Oscar party and can we come to it? Barack Obama. Uh, yes, I am, and no, you cannot. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> yes, you can. Uh, I wish yes, we ended on him. But hey, it's time for the hot topic. We haven't done that in a while. Let's do the hot topic. The hot topic.
Hey. All right, he may not be Barack Obama, but he's close enough. It's Alpha Cat. Hey. Hello. Hey. Will that dog get eaten by that tiger eventually? <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Barack Obama? Well, everyone's adopting black babies, so it must be a black tiger. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> play out okay. Uh, hey. <laughs> Bunny love. At the end of 2008, actor Iman Crossan, better known as Alpha Cat, exploded onto the YouTube scene. And he owes it all to one man. I, Barack Obama, do solemnly swear to faithfully execute the office of the President of the United States. Alpha Cat's been called the best Barack Obama impersonator in the country and has over 20 million video views to back it up. But this overnight sensation was a long time in the making. Ever since he learned to talk, Iman Crossan has been making people laugh. Iman's Jim Carrey impersonations impressed his parents enough that they actually sent him to a performing arts school. He studied acting and dance in college, and after graduation, packed up and moved to New York City. There, he found work recording dance routines for the New York Rangers halftime show, and also appeared on MTV's Wannabes. But Iman was finding it tough to break into better gigs. Putting this cabinet together... Uh, might be a little harder than we thought. So in May of 2007, he decided to promote himself by uploading his comedy sketches to YouTube. <laughs> then, in July of 2008, Iman found the opportunity he was looking for. Denny's Restaurants held a contest to find presidential candidate impersonators. Iman uploaded his entry to YouTube and won the grand prize. That's real great. That's the contest entry also netted him thousands more subscribers and encouraged Iman to focus on his Barack Obama impersonation. Uh, you talking to me, Taylor? You talking to me? Iman followed that with his biggest Obama video to date. On the night of the 2008 presidential election, he uploaded this spoof of T.I.'s Whatever You Like. First black press, I ain't that nice. I'm in the highest office, that's right now. I can do whatever I like. The major news outlets quickly picked up on the story, and Iman found himself at the center of a media frenzy. Fox's Bill O'Reilly called him a pinhead, and the L.A. Times compared him to Tina Fey's Sarah Palin impersonation. But Iman still wasn't done cranking out the hits. On inauguration day, he uploaded this brilliant presidential spoof of Beyonce's All the Single Ladies. That video scored Iman another 7 million views. Check out the YouTube spoof of President Obama singing Blame It on the Economy. <laughs> Blame it on the news, taxpayer blues, blame it on the loans, now your home's gone, blame it on the e e e, -e economy, blame it on the e e e, -e economy, blame it on Bush, blame it on Cheney, I'm not pointing blame, well okay maybe, blame it on the e e e, -e economy, blame it on the e e e, -e, 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 -e you know, uh, I am not actually Barack Obama, but I endorse this message. I endorse this message, yeah, yeah, yeah. Iman already has some great gigs lined up, including voice work as Barack Obama in two different primetime TV productions. We have four years of Iman's Obama impersonations ahead, and we'll be rooting for the second term so we get even more great videos from Iman. <laughs>